What really made me want to come to Juilliard was the callback weekend. After that three days, I already felt like I was a better actor. I was like, if that's what they can do in three days, I can only imagine what they'll do in four years. At Juilliard Drama, we want to prepare students to tell the stories that they're uniquely prepared to tell. We want to help our actors develop their bodies and voices to be as strong and as expressive as they can be, and for them to be able to use themselves as well as to transform. Who is the artist and what do you bring into the table? How does the text reveal something that is true within your own world? The drama division community is a rigorous, disciplined, passionate community. We like to think of our first year work as foundational. We start living in imaginary circumstances, trying to help the students get past the need to perform, get past self-consciousness. Asking us to exercise our imagination mm -hmm. as a kind of technique and as a muscle, I think is really exciting. Freeing up parts of your body that you're not even used to thinking about and realizing how that's connected to your emotions and your voice. The voice and the speech work and the movement work, because we do it in small classes, is so individualized. What we do is give you an immersion so you can put that time in and make mistakes, fail forward, take huge risks, find every facet of your arsenal so that you're really working at full capacity. It doesn't feel like the the voice classes are only voice or the movement classes are only movement, like you're really sort of working across the board. The second and third years we're expanding on that. I like to call it capacity building. We want to build their strength and their expressivity. And in the fourth year we really work to that bridge to the profession so that our students have the career skills to put the work that they now can do to use in the industry. I think those bare bones rehearsal projects prepared me uh, for believing in something when it's not there. So that in the third and fourth year, when we get costumes and makeup and you know all the bells and whistles that allow you to easily believe in the world that you're creating, uh, it, it all of a sudden feels easy. We want to help our playwrights develop their unique voices and give them the elements of craft that will help support a lifelong career. I think the mission of the Playwrights Program is to develop and nurture exciting new voices for American theater. We hope to find writers who are trying to tell stories that are engaging and potent and emotional and relevant. I mean, it's very scary to walk into a room and sit down with your heroes every week. They have such a love for I don't know, for the school and for the program itself and for the process of being a playwright in the program. I wanted to come to a program that was rigorous, that was tough, that would make me a better writer. Listening to the actors speak their words is an important part of the process because the writer also is listening to their own voice and that's part of cultivating their voice. One way in which Juilliard is unique is that our MFA and BFA actors study together in all studio courses. To have a different range of experience in the room is amazing. So many people in my class constantly surprise me with the knowledge that they've acquired. I've learned to be more playful and I like I take things very seriously. <laughs> and, so, <laughs> and so the BFAs have really like just to see their their curiosity and the way they tend to like, just leap into a new experience. If you just walk down a hall, you look into one studio and you see a trombone player tuning their instrument and then you go to the next studio and you see some drama students putting on like a Shakespeare performance. So just existing in this yeah. space is already invigorating by just activating the senses and looking up for two seconds and seeing all the different forms of art that's around you. Yeah, absolutely. There's a level of focus in the building when everybody's trying to be a master of their craft. When you can see that echoed in a dancer and the way they approach the work, in a musician, a cellist, or a harpist, it is evident in the halls, but also they get the opportunity to talk to each other and work together. I can't imagine a better artistic, cultural, political uh, community to be a part of. Walking into Juilliard feels like walking into a laboratory. What new thing about myself do I get to discover today? And in turn, what can I discover about humanity and the world around me? 